Hello yarn tubers! Welcome back to Dana's Wanderlust Crochet with Dana and Dooley. Um, we are in, this is an update on where I'm at, what I'm doing, um, boxes I've shipped out and um, a, a kind of a book review and a little happy mail that I didn't mention the other day. Dooley, come here. Yeah, do you want to say hi to people? He says, no, I want cookies, Mama. <laughs> I just want cookies. Just cookies. So we are in Payette. Um, I got back to work at noon yesterday and they gave me a load that I wouldn't have been able to deliver unless I drove until midnight last night. Um, which I did. And they unloaded me at, at uh, midnight last night, and I got to bed about 1.30, fell asleep about 2, and woke up at 5 and can't get back to sleep, or couldn't get back to sleep. I'm sure I could now. Uh, <laughs> we're sleepy. We're seepy, huh? Yeah. Seepy, seepy. So first of all, I want to thank Pam from Pamela's Creations for the beautiful card she sent me with a wonderful note inside. And it had tea in it, and I'd show you the tea, but I drank it immediately because it's, it's been, this card's been at home for a couple weeks. But as soon as I opened it, I drank the tea, so I loved it. Um, she sent me some stickers. And um, I do card making, so stickers always come in handy. Thank you, Pam. And I loved your wonderful note and your beautiful card. Thank you so much. I'm thinking I'm going to put it on my fridge. Keep it there. You know, I also thought about doing something, doing something back here that I could hang cards on and notes that I've received from you guys. I just I just think that would make a nice backdrop because I otherwise all I got is this Cascadia vinyl yeah that stuff <laughs> so um okay so yesterday um the reason I wasn't back to work until noon is because I needed a a weekday that wasn't a holiday um to uh, go to the post office. So I sent out Kelly Coleman's winnings from my last giveaway, finally. I sent uh, Daigo, Diana, her black licorice and some goodies in there. And I sent, oh, I sent June Little her birthday package. We, I think we messed up the postal code now because um, I didn't have one and Anyway, the gal at the post office, she's like, oh, here it is. And it turns out to be the wrong one. So I don't know what um, the Canadian um, Postal Service will do with that, whether it's going to come back to me. Because I did mark return to sender if, you know, undeliverable. I hope she just gets it because, you know, she's she's been waiting a while for her birthday gift. So, um, and also I sent D and Emily sample bag. And the rest of you, I'm going to start working on the um, list. I'm going to keep going down the list and send out those sample bags um, the next time I'm home. I don't know when that'll be. Uh, when I get this, when this load shows up from Americold, because uh, I didn't, you know, my break wouldn't have been up by the time I needed to scoot over there to pick up that load. So they sent someone else to pick it up. I'm supposed to deliver it, to deliver it at 5 a.m. on the 15th, which today is the 13th, um, in Tracy, California. So we'll see if I can make that uh, delivery on time. I'm certainly going to try. Um, I'm cooking bacon for my lunch. <laughs> I don't know if that's going to do it, but because I need to take my vitamins and they're, they're so concentrated. I was, this wasn't planned, but okay. So who was it? One of you, this, this, I wasn't planning on, but you know what? One of you told me 
to uh, take these, um, this uh, L-U-T-E-I-N, lutein, um, because I was whining about, you know, my night vision. Okay, so, and, you know, was saying that we could get it at Walmart. Well, I sell, I sell Neutralite products on my website. So, um, on my Amway website. So I went and checked and look what I sell on my website. See if I can get it to focus on that. Okay, so it says Vision Health with Lutein. And it's made by, by Neutralite. And I already take double X. And these are, um, um, these are pure plant-based supplements. Um, double X is one of the greatest vitamin supplements you can take. So when I found out they had this Vision Health, I grabbed it. Okay, so I take the, I started taking these Saturday morning. Today's Wednesday. I didn't take any yesterday because I um, I forgot. I left Brooks, Oregon at noon. I finally got out of Portland, Oregon with the load I was supposed to deliver at 3.30. And I've got to get to Fruitland, Idaho. So yeah, i got to drive through the night. I could see. And, and I don't know if it sees. I don't know. I don't know. But I could see. I, I, you know, by the time I got to the Huntington area, I was tired. And I was a zombie by the time I pulled into Fruitland. But I could see. So I, I'm sorry. I'll have to go back through my comments on that video. But thank you for suggesting this. Because that's the only thing I can think of. Is the vitamins. I have to take those vitamins on a full stomach. That's what, that's what I started to say. I'm cooking bacon for my lunch. Okay, so the other thing. Okay, so... Um, I've got some red heart here and I'm going to start on a on assignment number three and it's going to at least be double crochet but it's going to be a scarf and and I'm going to have them do it lengthwise because um, I just don't want it that complicated you know too many turns but they're going to get to know you know the three chain turning chain with a double crochet but I think I'm going to um also have you know I, I think I'm gonna do like a row of single crochet a row of half double and a row of double crochet and then um, you know change colors we're gonna make it lengthwise striped um, and utilizing all three of those you know stitches that we're learning up to this point you know some color changes Introducing them to, you know, the turning chain counting as the double crochet. Um, and then, you know, throw a border around it. I'm not going to do um, fringe. And that will be assignment number three. And I'm going to hope to get that uploaded within the next week or so. I still have to um, edit my uh, soap making video from uh, Aunt Martha's. Oh, funny. Oh, funny. Now I'm going to, I'm going to, um, give a little disclaimer. At one point, Aunt Martha dropped the F-bomb. <laughs> funny. Oh my goodness. <laughs> but I'm sorry. I, I, you know, I don't want to offend anybody, but I'm going to leave it in there. <laughs> she, and she's yelling at the microwave. She's not yelling at me or I would have, you know, <laughs> I would have melted. Okay, so um, the book review is the Crochet Stitch Bible. Okay, so what I was really looking for is like an old um, book. Something with a much older copyright. I couldn't find anything beyond like set the, you know, 70s in copyright. Um because I wanted to find something that I haven't seen on YouTube. I, I believe, you know, in going through this book, which is a wonderful reference, by the way. Love this as a reference book. They didn't have it in a Kindle version, so I went ahead and ordered it. Um, it is a nice book. Don't get me wrong. 
I'm just disappointed that I'm really not seeing anything that I haven't already seen on YouTube. I was looking for something new, I, I guess. Um, I, and I was hoping that if I went to something with a much older, like a hundred year old copyright on it, that I could find something with, you know, uh, stitches that we haven't, you know, seen on YouTube over and over again. But I do like this. I do like this. And I will probably use it to come up with an Afghan. Um, I started to do something that I thought was kind of an original idea with a mini corner to corner in squares. But I'm going to do a video talking to you guys and getting your opinion on it because, yeah, I'm just not sure that's going to do it. Uh, it didn't turn out. I talked to Dee about it at uh, Yarn Dragons Creations. Um, it's not turning out kind of like I thought it would. So anyway, I, you know, I will grab, you know, next time I'm home, I will show you what I've done and how it really isn't um, turning out like I thought it a would. A new message has arrived. A new message has arrived. <laughs> Dana, your trailer's there. You have to drive now. Blah. Hope not. But anyway, I do like this book. I do. I was just looking for something, you know, that was so vintage that most people hadn't seen it yet. I haven't found anything really that I haven't seen already. Um... But I do, I do appreciate what is in here. I mean, there's, you know, joining new yarn, changing colors, doing, you know, seams, um, in crochet. This is a, yeah, total, this is a great crochet book. And I really appreciate how they have it organized. And I would recommend it. I really would. Maybe I'll put it, I'll put an affiliate link in, you know, now that I'm an Amazon affiliate, I can put an affiliate link in the uh, description box. Shameless. Yeah. Um, but yeah, I do like this book. I think I first saw it on Petra's Happy Place. I saw something, or at least I saw something similar to it. And, and when I saw it, I thought, oh, I think that's the one I saw on Petra's. So that's why I went ahead and bought it. But really, um, I could use suggestions for a book. Um, that has, you know, an older copyright, something, you know, that really has something unique in it. Um, I wouldn't mind dropping down to a, uh, size two or size three yarn to make a pretty intricate, um, afghan. And that's kind of what I was looking for. But, um, and you know what, I, I'm sure if I apply myself, I can do something pretty unique using the stitches in this book. But, uh, I certainly, you know, of course I wouldn't be selling the pattern. It would just be something I'd show how to do on YouTube just for fun. Yeah. So anyway, that's what's going on here. Do you want to know what my message says? <laughs> Hang on. Duly entertain the people. Let's see. <clears throat> Team, I will be right back. I'm going to pick up lunch for Cindy and I. <laughs> okay, that's that's Jeremy, my DM. Um, him and his wife are both um, DMs, which which stands for driver manager. Is basic, you know, my dispatcher. Um, and him and his wife, you know, they work right next to each other. So that's what that's all about. So I can't. Uh, there's nothing. Okay, I'm just. Blah, 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 blah. I think I need a nap. <laughs> okay, I love you guys. Bye.